hot days, you know, really humid hot days. Been, you know, everybody's been pretty moist out there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I gave the guys a random work. Gave the guys a random work. Training camp, it was, it was good. It was like a good, like... It was a pretty good transition for me. It was definitely hard, though. It tested me. It showed me what I needed to work on just going into the season. And, um, you know, like, it showed me, like, the, the difference between college and the NFL. For real, so. And being on the Chiefs, you know, us being the, the team that we are, gave me a good idea of what to expect, you know, of, of the whole league. You know, so it's like, it was just a, a whole bunch of new things for me. So I say, training camp was what, is, it was needed, you know. This whole preseason process, it was it was needed for me to to, to be the player I want to be. And, you know, it gave me time to, like, make mistakes and correct them, basically. Keep the fluids in, you know what I'm saying? Let's build. Big old three, one, two, three. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> hey, hey, never let this guy break it down. Never let this guy break it down. Nah, nah, nah. Y'all had a beautiful pack today. I respect y'all. Men and men. They were like, oh, that's weed. When it's hot. Yeah, I got my, my PT. We about to pull up. Get me ready for the game so the man will work. And then after that, you know, chill for a little bit when I'm hitting the road. You gotta be at the stadium at five. Get this done real quick. And then we for real after this one. The first two games were cool. It was just like me getting my feet wet. Like going out there, seeing how the, how people fly around, how the how the calls come in in the game, you know, with throws Pat and Chad like to make. You know, just just being just being on the NFL scene. It was good just to be out there for real. I'm back deep for a punt and it was like, and back deep we got Sky Moore. The crowd went crazy. That was hard, but I feel like I feel like I'm waiting for a different moment though. You know what I'm saying? Like I need I need to see the regular season. Like I need to be in the regular season game. All summer I've heard Oh, uh, Coach Reed versus the hardest training camp. Uh, like, all oh, the receivers better be ready to run, all that, you know. Then I, I kind of, like, knew it going in, but, like, know, like knowing what you're doing and, and actually going through it is two totally different things. So, it was just it was just a, a, a good challenge. And not just physically, it was mentally, too. Like, you did it for a month and a half or however long. It felt it felt like forever, but it, it definitely you know challenges you mentally and physically. I just literally go in at like at ten fifty. That's what I'm saying, man. Sleep. You go on there, mission. You ain't late. Yeah. You know. Ten. I seen Trav like, <laughs> Trav rolled in at like ten fifty nine. Yeah, yeah. Tra look, cause Trav is still out in the car yeah, until right. you know until he has to be in there. You know what I'm saying? Like he ain't. He ain't trying to spend one extra second because you know what it is. Mm -hmm. I mean, you got a roommate? Yeah. Yeah. Leo. Yeah. He's a linebacker. <laughs> yeah, so I'm a physical therapist. Um, you know, we've been doing some work together. Um, we're just really trying to get, you know, get things cleaned up before the game. You know, we had a couple spots yesterday we found uh, that were just a little tight. You know, I mean, it's hard, you know, coming out of camp, coming out of practice. Um, so, you know, just addressing some of the areas that we found were a little tight yesterday, just kind of reassessing, making sure that, you know, the more we can do here, the less he has to do on the field before the game. So, if we can get some things loose, warmed up, activated here, then, you know, he's just going to feel that much better, that much quicker when he gets to the field today. So, um, we did some dry needling yesterday, we did some manual work, we kind of made sure the hits were in alignment, we're going to just kind of, you know, it's final tuning, you know, making sure that, you know, we had a couple hours before game time, make sure those hits are in alignment, make sure that things are staying nice and loose, activate a little bit today, and then, you know, kind of know what we have now going into the off day tomorrow, so we can continue to kind of just address things and make sure that we're 
you know, not, not only staying healthy for the season, but, you know, able to really attack some things that we know we, we still need to improve on during the season. Like you said, it just it helps me warm like warm up my body faster. So like I'm already after he gets out of here, I'm already gonna be tight loose. So once it's time for the game, it is just it's like reactivating instead of activating initially. Not starting from scratch. Right. And like yeah, like in college, but also in college I felt like we got a more of a warm up too. You know what I'm saying? Like more of like they did a good job, at least at Western, making sure we was loose. You know, here it's like they it's on, you got to do that by yourself. You're pro. You yeah. know, they gonna let you do kind of what you want to do. Right. You know, and hopefully, you know, I mean, guys, you know, most guys are gonna take that serious, but it's also tough because some guys just don't. They don't know. Right, yeah. You know, they don't know what to do. Exactly. <laughs> and, that's a, and that's a lot of, my, like, that's, that's a lot of, of the problem. You not knowing what to yeah. do. You know you got to do something. <laughs> yeah, you just yeah. don't know what to do. Yeah, you definitely can't walk out, you know. You don't be walking out there doing nothing, you know. Yeah. Like, honestly, like, for real, I don't feel the, I don't really feel the difference right now between practice and the game. Because I'm, I'm, when I go out there, I'm not, like, it's not like college where it's like, oh, you can like chill and practice and get ready for the game. It's like, when I go out there, I be thinking like, this is the game. And it, and it sounds cliche, but like, no, nah, like, you can't just go out there and do anything in practice. So it's, it's, it's been like kind of the same for me. Like, I don't put too much pressure on the game. I probably put more pressure in practice, more pressure on myself in practice than in the game. I don't know, it sounds weird. Yeah, practice for sure prepared me for at least a preseason game. But, you know, yeah, well, like, you, like you said, though, like, once you start rolling, like, I'll get to fill out how what a regular season game feels like. Because these games, like, our whole schedule is going to be important. So, we're going into a Super Bowl every week. That's how, that's how we're coming into it. Look at that. Guys, a random word to try to sneak into their press conferences. Let's see how they did. The word is minions. That's like with Pat, you ain't you're not getting underthrown here. So you know we're just a bunch of minions out there running. <laughs> is flamingo. I'm serious, man. It's a, it's a serious thing off the field. You know, a lot of guys try to flamingo in. They try to. Uh, just leave He's it crazy. <laughs> It's funny when guys just throw the word out there. They're just like, you know, I can't get this in there, so I'm just gonna throw the word out. Moist. Oh, uh, that's hot days. You know, really humid hot days. You know, everybody's been pretty moist out there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I gave the guys a random word. Gave yeah, the guys a random word. This last preseason game, we're gonna close the preseason out with the Packers, and I'm gonna just, you know, develop like a routine just to get ready for. Ready for week one? See, see what um. Once I see what the schedule is, because I still haven't really got a feel for like what the weekly schedule is, is because like during the regular season. So after this game, we get on that type of schedule, and I'll be able to like carve out, carve out my little routine, and you know get ready to suit up for real.
Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that was tough. Yeah, I'm funny, yo. <laughs> no, because Juju was like, Juju was like, he said, I was like, because I for, I be forgetting the plays. And I was like, I was like, yo, Juju, did, uh, did I get tackled or did I just go out of bounds? Right. I didn't know. Yeah. He was like, I don't know. And then he just had some late-ass celebrations. <laughs> yeah. I got up. No, I looked at him. I got up, got tackled. I was like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that was so funny. And then, and then Coach Reed, look, he came over to me and was on some like, because I had, I had that play, mm -hmm. then the second punt return, and then, um, oh, the pass interference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he was like, all right. He was like, we're going to shut him down. We're going to shut him down. <laughs> hey. And I'm like, right, hold up. I'm like, that's the earliest y'all ever showed me this. But I think it was like this. I think like I don't remember. Like it, but my phone, I got that joint tape. <laughs> no, they, they might have. I got it on my iPad, like yeah, yeah. the actual drink. Yeah. <laughs> like, and, then I, and then I just let him like. But the move on him before that, which made him hold you. When yeah. He grabbed you. Yeah. Yeah. Burned yeah. I burnt no. I burnt him off the post the first time. And then he like grabbed my shoulder. I'm like, okay, he's gonna grab. In the second time, uh, yeah. Okay, yeah, I got you. Cause look, I was supposed to go inside. I was supposed to take an outside release, but as soon as we jumped, as soon as he jumped on the snap, as soon as the snap came, he jumped out. So I'm like, all right, I ain't going now. I'm going in. I'm thinking like, what the heck? You're good out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I seen you looking. I thought I, I seen you. You, you. Yeah, I, I, like, I wanted to go like this, but I was like, I don't know if you're talking to somebody, but I seen you. I, like, seen, I knew what my mom said the yeah. last time. Is you was like by yourself. You was like, Y'all ain't had no, y'all ain't, y'all wasn't like giving me no indicators y'all was up there either. No, but see, I didn't know what you were looking at. I would, if you would have no, been yeah, like, I would have like, you was like by yourself, like to the side, and I'm like, is he looking up here? And I was like, nah, let me not look. We want to hype like your mom be like. No, they had a sign on the side, 21. I know exactly where they are right. in time. No, I just be liking to know that. No, yeah, I, I, I knew you were looking because I was like, "Who's he looking at?" No, that was good. Though. Get ready for next week. It's gonna be hot out there, bitch. No, oh, hey, it's seven. We got seventeen days. So next week, I'll be in Kalamazoo. Oh no, no, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But the next game, I know it, it's not gonna be hot. That's, That's in the dome. dome. That's the GOAT. Jerry Rice. He just followed me and I'm not following him back. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> Say no. <laughs>